then we have our uh, calcineurin inhibitors, our non-steroid, but in many respects is very similar in terms of efficacy or, or what we would expect with a steroid. They are approved for both acute flares and maintenance therapy in adults and children ages two and up. In Europe, they're, all, they're approved for maintenance uh, specifically as part of their indication. In the U.S., it's really approved for the acute flares, but we have lots of data to show that they work well for prevention as well. And these can be used in combination with topical corticosteroids. Uh, they can be used on sensitive skin areas while topical corticosteroids are used on other parts of the body. They can be mixed and matched. They can be used as monotherapy. So a lot of flexibility here because you don't have those ther steroid uh, side effects and because this would be a good steroid sparing option for patients. Frequency of use is similar to the corticosteroids, twice daily application for treatment of acute flares, two to three times a week for proactive maintenance. And here we can often use a little more frequently during the week for maintenance than the corticosteroids, again, because we're not worried about the thinning of the skin. The adverse events here are really just local uh, application site reactions, burning, stinging, or itch, uh, which often is transient, but does come up quite a bit and uh, for some patients can be more persistent. Uh, systemic side effects are really thought to be quite rare. We don't recommend any kind of blood monitoring for these patients. And of course, there is a component of education required for patients with respect to the boxed warning. It is a theoretical black box warning around malignancy, although uh, the manufacturers of both of the topical calcineurin inhibitors have done 10-year post-marketing registries that have really shown absolutely no signal for malignancy, but it is still something that patients are concerned about and one that we do need to educate them about, and so it takes a little more time.